I just thought I'd let you know that I managed to finish all of the Kickstarter stuff earlier this week. Lots and lots of stuff has been uh, finished, accomplished, I'm feeling very, very um, happy with it all. Um, I just thought I'd let you know the Kickstarter is ready to go. So what I'm going to do is launch it tomorrow on Sunday. So by the time this vlog goes out on Monday, there will be a link down below in the video description and hopefully, fingers crossed, it's a success. I am a bit nervous, just gonna put it out there, I'm a bit nervous because this is kind of like my first big step into like returning to work after eight months of taking time off for maternity leave, so I'm just a bit like, mm. So the campaign is gonna run for two weeks, which is hopefully, um, what I've tried to do is looking at my manufacturing times and also just the time of year um, and also like with my shop reopening and stuff and the time that it takes to release the funds to me so once the campaign has finished and if it's successful it takes another two weeks I think um, on average for the funds to be released to you so that you can then um, go and order your manufactured goods. So I'm hoping it's going to run for two weeks, it's going to end on the 28th of August I think I've got down. There's a fly on the top of my camera. I think my shop is going to open on the 31st of August. I'm aiming for that date anyway. But yeah, the Kickstarter is going to finish on the 28th, so we've got two weeks to try and scrape together as much as we can to bring in the new products to the shop. I think it's approximately two weeks again um, of manufacturing times and then they'll be shipped to me and I'm hoping that I will get them in really good time for Halloween which is why everything might seem a bit like right, go 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 but it's literally a case of right Halloween is coming these designs are kind of spooky and I'd love to get them in the shop for Halloween. So I have gone to get some updated sort of backgrounds to have a play with just a tip go to your local hardware store wallpaper samples just rip a bit off they work great as backgrounds um obviously within reason i don't want you getting into trouble for trying to take an entire roll because i just literally take a small sample and i thought this one was pretty interesting it's kind of you know like kind of french french style decor giving it but I'm thinking I'm just gonna go with the wood it's nice and kind of you know universal and it's gonna look nice against all of the products so obviously I need to take a lot of fairy toast for all of the new products but it is so warm at the moment so I was going through my fabric drawer and um, realized I had some pink fabric left um, but also some pink zips so when I was ordering some more fabric the other day I thought I'd bring back the badges for another spin because I know how much you guys loved the badges um, and I just thought I'd bring it back I've only got a small piece this time around so um, they'll be very very limited but I wanted to bring the badges back just because I've also got some supplies that um, I could use up to make the badges with there's also these bunnies I do want to get back on the stuffed animals thing eventually um, I didn't like the shape of the face with this one I wanted it to protrude a bit more um, but the body I was happy with and like the little arms and things um, I didn't stuff it as much as I would like to have done um, but I need to I think as we approach like Christmas sort of time I will re-look into like kind of little critters and things um, but yeah I want to bring them back it's just that I've had so much to kind of think about and um, and then I have got lots and lots of green so I thought that um, I would bring a froggy fabric out which has to be one of my all-time favorite fabrics um, that I've ever brought to my shop I absolutely love it so I've also been and got some zips and things um, I did originally go for this yellow because I have got some yellows already in my drawer again I've got stuff to use up from you know previous this drawer needs an entire tidy it's, it's honestly shameful um, but yeah I've got some yellow ones but they only have two in stock so I bought this coloured one which I don't actually know what the colour is but I think it works a bit better for the for the colour scheme what do you think 
I like the yellow and it works, but I think it's a bit too bright. Um, so I might, you know, keep them to one side and just go back and get this colour because I just think it's really nice. I think it's like an antique gold colour or something, but it just like works so much better with with the colours. I have got some dragon fabric left in my drawer as well. And, and I've got more zips for um, bats too because I've got bat fabric here that I can use and I've also got like, still quite a bit of a, a very generous amount of toadstools left there so yeah over the next couple of weeks we're going to be doing a lot of sewing and um, yeah I don't know mm, there's so much going on in this drawer I really need to tidy it. also have some bias binding uh, left from Christmas time so um, if I can't there's a pin in there honestly this drawer I haven't really properly gone through this drawer since Christmas time so there's oh Alice Alice yeah there's always something going on in here So I think I might try and also squeeze a few sets of bunting in um, for the shop update at the end of the month. really really hot today I think it's the last day of this particular heat wave but it's so uncomfortable just a constant state of sticky grumpy but I just wanted to thank you all um the kickstarter went live last night and it's doing really well um I didn't really sleep very much last night because I was just so um like overwhelmed in a really good way just really excited um I've had a little cry you know done the whole routine I will tell you where we're at as of right now. We haven't long unlocked the frog washi tape, so that one is going to be made. Uh, that one was design number nine, so there's one more to unlock, um, which is just like insane to me because 
it's not even been live for 24 hours yet and it's already doing really really well like better than I could ever have hoped for and I'm just really really grateful thank you for bearing with me whilst I've been you know off on maternity leave and just trying to muddle on through it has been a scary time and it has been scary too I was like my finger on the launch button last night was just like what am I doing can I do this who do I think I am but um I think because I've been out of it for so long it's kind of gonna take a little bit of time to kind of you know get back into it and feel where I once was with it all but also with an understanding that it's gonna look kind of different to how it was when I was last sort of working on my business to this sort of extent so yeah just thank you so much for um having that faith in me and supporting a project that um has been sort of ongoing in the background since the beginning of the year really oh the baby's awake it does feel really great to have been plugging away at this for like the majority of the year so far and finally be able to put it out into the world and be several steps closer to actually having the products manufactured and then if we're on track we will have them in the shop as well for Halloween um, but don't forget if you pledge via the Kickstarter they are discounted so you'll get them at a discounted rate via the Kickstarter I think there's some early bird slots left as well so you can get them even more discounted if you go through that route and there's also the notepads as add-on items as well if you fancy a new notepad for your desk but yeah, I just wanted to say thank you. Um, I've just heard that my son has just woken up from his nap, which is perfect timing. So we're going to go and have our mid-morning snack. But I just wanted to end the vlog by saying thank you so, so much from the bottom of my heart. It really means a lot. And I can't wait to send washi tapes out to you. I'll see you soon.